hi guys welcome back to today's vlog i'm so excited because in today's vlog we get to set up and plan and deliver our friend's proposal so myself and k are headed for the venue and today esther is going to be proposed to in a few hours time she has no idea and we've lied to her about all the things that we are up to today today is saturday so let's go inside and start setting up yes 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 let me keep this So her boyfriend reached out to us a couple of weeks ago. We created a WhatsApp group and started to plan. We started to like chat with her to ask her what kind of proposal she wanted. But stylishly, of course, so she has no idea this is happening. Everything here, most of them were ordered from Amazon and uh ours, yeah. ours, candles, verses and the marry me sign. That's all that is here. Tango, we got these ones. Hi. Ah, okay. Happy birthday. Oh, thank you. Because <laughs> I'm now wondering. <laughs> Is that one also in life? <laughs> As for the vases, we did get them from Dollarama, but the inflated balloons, the petals, some of the petals are from Amazon, while some other petals are from um, Dollarama. Because the Amazon ones arrived and I noticed that they were so few, so I had to go to Dollarama to source for red petals as well as pink and white. So that's everything that is happening here today. She has called us today already to ask about our our saturday like how are you doing what's up I, I had to come up with a lie and tell her that i was doing my hair or whatever like i just came up with one nonsense lie like that and then kate told her that she was working so she had no idea she has no idea about what is coming uh we got inflatable helium tank helium actually inflatable helium for the balloons so that the balloons stay up and we're actually doing this at a friend's place so this is her fiance's friend's house so she was kind enough to allow us to do the proposal and the setup in her place she's such a nice person and uh yeah so let's just get back right into it and uh yeah yeah he wants to help i don't know where she came from kind of turned me upside down i just don't know what to do I wanna spend the night at hers and bring her one of my t-shirts so it smells like her perfume. Now I really get what the love songs are talking it about. Has like the and I just wanna tell her how I feel, scream it out loud. Have you ever been in love? Have you ever lost your head? Have you felt like you were out of breath when you saw her in that dress? When your heart is beating fast and you're sweating and you can't stop looking at her smile So we're fluffing the petals, we've tested out the candles, we've fluffed more petals We got, we ran out of, way from here, <laughs> we ran out of helium so we got another, uh, another jar And then so far this is what it's looking like I tell her baby please don't go I think you should stay with me And I, I really get what the love songs are talking about Oh, and I just want to tell her how I feel Scream it out loud Have you ever been in love? So we are almost done And as you can see, they are doing their makeup They are doing their makeup They are doing their makeup mm -hmm. Natural air is not good for 
Mm -hmm. Events. Mm -hmm. I don't worry, I'll come person proposal alone. <laughs> Problem. Then they come, then they come, operate me. <laughs> So at this point everything was set up and we're waiting for them the couple wanted a private moment so all the friends were supposed to go and hide inside until we heard her say yes and then it would be our cue to come out and then celebrate with them so i had set up my phone somewhere to just um film the whole like the part of where she comes in and all of that because i wasn't watching this so yeah we had one or two people outside to help coordinate the music and yeah this was the moment it happened i'll stay with you Today is Monday night, and uh, yeah, uh, yesterday Sunday I went to, <laughs> to do this thing here. It reminds me of when I was in secondary school and we used to have thread hair. So basically, what this is is uh, I'm on natural hair, so I have type four C hair or whatever, and I'm trying to stretch it out. You're going to see a lot of smoke coming. That's because I'm in the kitchen. I'm trying to stretch my hair out and. Rather than using heat, I decided to use I decided to use the thread. So my friend did that for me. So current situation, I'm in the kitchen. I have my hoodie on and I have my apron and I'm actually making dinner. Let me show you. So I'm actually making dinner. So it's rice and stew. As you can see, the rice is almost done. So I think I need to even reduce this heat because it's already done and then i'm a frying fish here uh yeah so it's actually fish stew i'm also bored and i decided to start this thing on show max so this is the mommy club it's a show i don't know if it's great or not i was watching the real housewives of lagos recently and i'm done with that and i decided to try this one and see if i would like it i just started you can see season one episode one so nothing crazy yet over the weekend i planned the proposal for my friend these flowers were from the proposal and that's why i have them here on my counter and i do have these dried flowers so i did see on twitter there was this babe that dried her flowers for over three weeks and then she said they lasted for a year so i tried it out my husband got me flowers and i dried it for three weeks like i tied it in my winter jacket closet and after i think two weeks or so i brought it out and this is what it looks like it's dried but i would i just wanted to try it out with these flowers now that i know that it works i would go and get like real flowers and do all of that a few minutes ago i was on the couch as you can see i'm all over the place I was doing Bible study here and that's pretty much it. Hi guys. <sighs> Welcome to another day in the life. <laughs> I'm actually at the mall and I'm looking for um what is the name of this place? Bath and Body Works. And then I'm also here to return something I got from H&M.
and like I said, I got something online and I would like to return and get my money back because I no longer like the item and I had to wait for that item for a very long time and I kind of lost interest in the item so now I'm going to return it. Recycle, what, what is it about? Uh, you can bring in like old clothes for HM. No, it doesn't need to be. Oh, it doesn't need to be HM, it could be anyone. And we can give you uh, some points. Uh, oh, to okay. okay. Yeah. All right, thank okay. you. Sure. So, after three days, it will be back in my account. Exactly. All right, thank you. Have a good day. Okay. So I finished getting stuff. I'm actually going to Superstore now because I we have I was invited to a potluck this weekend, uh, this Saturday. So I want to quickly. I said I was going to go there with this dodo. Like that's what I signed up to take. So I want to go and buy plantain and gizzard. Today is Wednesday, so hopefully the plantain I'm buying should not be too ripe so that by Saturday morning. Because me, I don't want to come out of my house again, at least for the next couple of days. But yeah, and then since I, saw, uh, since I was, and then since I was already out, I was just like, you know what? It's better for me to just get these things right now. What are you doing? I'm crossing on the red light. It's better for me to just get these things right now, rather than come back, rather than come back on Friday. So. Let's go. Hmm. So I'm just going to take this one. Guys, at this point, it's safe to say that there's almost no city that you go to that you will not find in Nigeria and that you probably know. Tell me why I was just walking on the road. I was listening to I said what I said, like I had headphones on and then I just look up and I see someone that I've known for a while and we've been communicating but we've never met. Like I've been talking to her from Nigeria and boom, I see her and like I recognize her. <laughs> like the whole thing is so funny because the other day I went to church, my friend invited me to her church for the first time and when she told me she was like this is a nigerian church i'm like the fact there's a nigerian church there's almost no way almost no way that i wouldn't find like me see someone that i know there and we walk into church church is done i'm coming out and i see my secondary school senior's husband like i've never met him before i've just seen him on instagram based on when she posts and immediately i saw him i just knew that uh -uh. I just went and met him. I'm like, hi, are you so so and so person's husband? And then I turn and I see his wife. And his wife was my senior in secondary school. Like, what are the odds? And then today again, this is happening. Anyway, well, yeah, that's it. <laughs> guys so good morning today is what is today man i don't keep track of days anymore but so i meet up with my friends and was supposed to hang out somewhere in the city center so somewhere in downtown and i'm ready and these girls are nowhere to be found i should have known that they would do african time anyway i can't even do outfit check because i'm inside i'm on the road well let me cross the road first anyway back to the story these girls are nowhere to be found they are not ready and we're supposed to meet at this particular street train stop here in downtown and i can't find them i can't find them they've called me and told me one told me sorry she's still doing her makeup like what is wrong with Kia and esther man 
but yeah let's appreciate the beauty my hair refused to have sense that's why i tied it and it's even opening i need to tie this calf in bits tighter let me get to that stop and i'll just sit there and do it but yeah the weather is so good today at i think it's like three degrees so it's not so bad thank god for this warm days so guys look at the the two women that finally decided to grace me with their presence after taking forever but whatever guys you know we didn't even plan it and we are all in white yeah like <laughs> we didn't plan so we didn't plan it and we're all wearing white Saturday is finally here and it's time to make the geese dodo. I have my dodo, I have plantain, plantain is dodo. <laughs> I have my vegetable scots, my gizzard has already been fried and plantain is frying currently and I blended some peppers and ready to cook this meal. So that's that about this vlog, it was just a week in my life. I hope you enjoyed this video, do not forget to subscribe, do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Do not forget to drop a comment and I will see you guys very soon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. be patient and I work it out. But the doctor had patience, so it weren't around. And now I'm back to always. I ain't complaining though. I'm liking that heat while it takes me underground. But I ain't looking, he can find me. I'm living right on the beat. I don't need them when I got me. They want it, but I want the keys. I ain't looking. He can find me. I'm living right on the beat. I don't need them when I got me. They want it, but we all want to dream more. No, don't believe what they preach. I prefer when they talking.